Greetings. When I was in college at the UW Stevens Point School, one of the organizations I was involved in was Amnesty International. During the later time I was involved in Amnesty International, we had a file folder online that had letters we were supposed to write. They had a template such as fill in your name and address and send it to the leader of Bulgaria because Bulgaria is torturing or whatever. In one of the folders one time, one of my buddies in the organization who had a similar sense of humor that I did, he put in a file that was just a, a joke. And it didn't make any sense, but I asked him about it and it was a joke. So what I did is I used the file folder to do some jokes involving him. Now he was from Manitowoc, Wisconsin, and he was a Parks and Recreation employee there, a lifeguard to be particular. So I used that as the humor. So I'm going to read you some of the letters I created to that effect. Your street address. And it is the director of Parks and Recreation Council. My friend said he thought it was particularly funny how I actually looked up and found the actual name of the director and put it on the file. It says, Dear Director, I am ready to express concern about reports that hazardous chlorine from the city of Manitowoc swimming pool has been draining into the Michigan River. The Michigan River is a precious and rare ecosystem which the Sierra Club recommends the preservation of. The drainage of chlorine into the Michigan River is irresponsible, deadly, and destructive. Recent independent tests have determined that the Michigan River has the highest chlorine levels in the entire nation. John Mildon of the Environmental Research Center was quoted as saying the level of chlorine in the Michigan River is extremely dangerous. Anyone who drinks or bathes with water obtained from this river will likely develop cancers of the kidneys, gallbladders, appendices, and throat. Also, there's a great danger of stroke, cardiac arrest among users of this water. Since the city of Manitowoc attains 97% of its water supply, the welfare of the citizens of Manitowoc is in jeopardy. I urge you to bring in the EPA to conduct an independent and impartial investigation into the conduct of Manitowoc Parks and Recreation Council employees. Your name. Now my friend had a great sense of humor so he found these pranks funny. Good for him. Have a great day.